Welcome to Dynamic Foundry Group. Today we are going to see a small video on charge cost control and optimization in gray cast iron. Why charge cost is so important? As we all know, the cost involved in the melting is almost 50% of the total cost in the foundry. So any saving here will definitely help the organization to make a good savings and help to improve upon the profitability and contribution of the foundry. So we are going to see a cast iron charge mix now. It, is, it includes pig iron, MS scrap, cast iron boring, runner riser, cast iron rejection, and cast iron scrap. So here we can see pig iron 50 kg, MS 180 kg, boring 0 kg, runner riser 150 kg, rejection 150 kg, total is 530 kg, and the cost coming 31.09. You can please note here that the boring use is zero, which has a rate of 28 rupees per kg and uh, runner riser together, uh, runner riser rejection together are 300 kg, which almost costs 31 rupees per kg. So the cost, total cost here of the charge is 31 rupees 9 paisa. Now this is second case where we have introduced boring 50 kg now and uh, rejection and runner riser 250 kg. So we are not going to change PIGAN and MS scrap here. We are keeping PIGAN and MS as a constant and we are working on boring runner riser and rejection alone. We are changing these three figures together to see what will be the charge cost at the for that particular charge. Here uh, with boring 50 kg and runner riser, rejection 250 kg cost comes around 30 rupees 81 paisa we go to the third slide where boring is now 100 kg and runner risers together uh, with the rejection is 200 kg the cost is 30 rupees 53 paisa we go to the fourth case where boring is 100 150 kg whereas rejection and runner riser is 100 kg the cost coming 30 rupees 17 17 paisa so now if we summarize the these four cases, we can see boring from 0 to 150, the cost varies from 31 rupees 9 paisa to 30 rupees 17 paisa. So almost with almost 30% of boring, that is 150 kg of boring, will give you a cost benefit of rupees 90 paisa per kg of liquid metal, which is a huge cost for you. So this is how it impacts on the cost. This is another important factor is uh, using uh, same grade of uh, risers, particularly higher grade risers for the same grade of casting production. Here you can see the uh, manganese and copper, particularly copper here. Uh, copper, you can see the risers which are used or runner risers or rejection which is used is having 0.0% uh, of copper. So uh, we are not using uh, FG300 grade uh, risers for FG300 grade. We are using lower grade risers for FG300, which requires almost addition of 1.05 kg of copper. So almost one kg copper is required because we are not using the risers of higher grade uh, risers to the higher grade uh, casting production. We are using lower grade risers for that. We can see the second slide here. You can see the copper content in the riser is 0.2%. So the requirement of copper now reduced to 0.69 kg. That is uh, almost 700 grams, we can say. So almost 350 kg, that is 350 grams of additional copper is required if the grade-wise runner riser and rejections are not used for the higher grade. This 350 grams or 0.35 kg copper is almost rupees 150, which is almost 0.3 rupees per kg of liquid metal. So almost 30 paisa per kg of liquid metal cost is increased because we have not used the higher grade risers for the higher grade of production. So it is very important to have uh, this discipline in the melt shop. So we have to incur 0.3 per kg of liquid metal extra cost if grade wide runner riser are not utilized in gray cast iron for the higher grade. So conclusion, if you see the chart, you can say that you will be saving almost 
90 paisa cost per kg of liquid metal if you use around 30 percent of cast and boring apart from this if you utilization of runnerizer is 100 percent the available spillage is used 100 percent then it will save a lot of money which are otherwise blocking because of unnecessary inventory of material so it's important to finish up all the spillage all the riser you have so that you can uh, avoid blockage of this uh, kind of material and your inventory will get down in your inventory cost will come down so it is very important so to save cost material management is most important also using grade wise runner riser will always helps you to reduce the cost of alloys this is also seen in our slide that most almost 0.30 rupees 0.3 per kg of liquid metal that is 30 paisa per kg of liquid metal is saved if runner risers are used for the higher grade of melting so you can say one more slogan i will just like to remind you this slogan i have already uh, share it with you on various occasions again i'm just repeating it do not add carbon at the end instead of adding carbon keep sub crca or a scrap aside so as to avoid late addition of coke or graphite so this is very important slogan so thank you very much for patient hearing and hope you enjoyed this video